Hey guys, welcome to the video today. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix a glove box that's opening too fast like this one here. And your glove box should be opening slower like this. So if it's opening too fast, it's most likely because of a part that's called the glove box damper. And I've disconnected the glove box damper on my 2006 Toyota Corolla to show you how fast the glove box will open if that part isn't hooked up correctly or is missing or is broken. And on my 2006 Toyota Corolla, the glove box damper goes right here. And let's take a closer look at it. Okay, so this is the damper for my 2006 Toyota Corolla. And this piece right here hooks up to the glove box. And as the glove box drops down, that allows the glove box to drop down slowly like it should. So if this part is not connected properly or is missing or is broken, then your glove box won't open slowly like it should. It will just drop down fast like I was showing you earlier. Okay, so if you need to install a new damper, I'll show you on my 2006 Toyota Corolla how to do that. And if you have an old one that's still hooked up and maybe it's broken, you'll have to disconnect it from the glove box. And on my 2006 Toyota Corolla, uh, we take out that screw right there and then the damper would just pop off the glove box. Okay, so the next thing we need to do is remove the glove box and on my 2006 Corolla it's clipped in down here and down here and then we need to pinch the sides of the glove box in. So let me do that now. There we go. Uh, now that we have the glove box removed, let me show you how to install the damper. Okay, so there's a clip right there and the damper will just install onto the clip like so. And now we're ready to attach the damper to the glove box. Okay, so now we can reinstall the glove box and I'm going to put the clips on the bottom back in first and then pinch in the sides and we'll make sure that it's seated in there properly. Then we can attach the arm from the damper uh, to the glove box like so and then we can reinstall the screw. Okay. Okay, so let's test the glove box and make sure that it's working like it's supposed to and we can see that it is. And this is going to be a different process on different vehicles, but I hope this video has given you an idea of why your glove box might be opening too fast and not opening slowly like it's supposed to. And if you're missing the damper for your glove box, you can try taking a look online or getting a hold of your local dealership to see if the part's still available. So I hope this video has helped you guys out and thank you so much for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment. And I hope to see you guys in the next video. Have a good one. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment. And if you have the time, check out these other great videos.